they should be coming up live now. Yeah, there we are. Um, so I've purchased Star Control Origins. You're just seeing a black screen now. I'm going to use this moment to test some audio. One, two, three. So it is, yep, okay, good. So it is um, loading now, and I'm, I've never even launched this game before, so I'm going to see how OBS takes it. I may need to adjust. There we go. Wonderful. So I'm going to be playing this purely based on my nostalgia for the original. Singularity formed, its creators uplifted into something beyond our understanding. Beyond our understanding. These beings, now known as the Lexites, left Earth, traveling to multiple planets in our solar system before vanishing altogether. This is why we are here. Welcome to Star Control, a state-of-the-art international space agency tasked with the exploration of our solar system and the defense of Earth. Here resides the world's brightest minds and greatest technology, brought together by a strong curiosity to discover the unknown. Help us pioneer the future. Join today. Alright, I'm sold. I'll join today. Looks like Orabesh or something like that. like the original
We believe this is an alien transmission. And this is originating from where, exactly? It's local. Triton. Recall the captain. Tell him that he's needed. He's still on administrative leave from the incident. That no longer matters. He's the only one qualified to command the prototype Vindicator. Oh, okay, well. Oh, I see. Then here's where we go. Always. I call the ship. The last of the crew and supplies should be coming over to you shortly, Captain. Time to get started. Star Control is ordering you to travel to Triton and investigate the alien radio signal that's originating there. Okay. It's just a series of regular pulses at 1.42 gigahertz. That's the hydrogen line, in case you've forgotten your radio astronomy. Some very excitable men in glasses are pretty sure if aliens ever try contacting us, they'll do it on that frequency. They, they are like substantially less nerds. certain why aliens might be on one of Neptune's moons, though. Scan its surface from orbit. If you find the signal, send one of your ship's landers down to the surface to examine it further. If it is an alien, you are ordered to not die and tell us right away. <laughs> sure, you die as much as you want, Captain. Just send the ship back. Not entirely. Their departure is the whole reason we have a star control in the first place. Your mission to Triton takes priority, but if you do discover anything concerning the Lexites, you should tell us right away. Sure, Captain. Sure, Captain. You've already forgotten how to captain a starship, Captain? <laughs> That's not a good sign. What do you want to know? Ah, that's it. Hope that helps, Captain. I'm a rogue. I fly by the seat of my pants. Star Control has accelerated the construction of our new modular deep solar system vessel specifically for this mission. It's the fastest, most expensive ship humanity has ever made, Captain. Try not to lose it. It's also equipped with our latest resource collection landers, which I would encourage you to make heavy use of. We used up a lot of materials to make that thing. If we want to make any more Vindicator-class vessels, we're going to need you to collect the resources to do it. Looks like you've got everything stowed away now, Captain. You're all set. Good luck, Let's and please hurry. There are a lot of people down on Earth anxious to find out what's going on. zoom out so much. Um, okay. Just using up 
do. This pretty much seems to fly just like uh, the original. Oh, okay, you don't have to do anything major. Captain, we've located the source of the radio signal. It looks like there's a crashed ship down there. We should take a lander down to investigate. Okay. Landing it. Thrust. Strafe. Oh, I see. Okay. Uh, what are the control controls went away? Oh, there we go. Boost. That looks like a resource. Resource collected. Press tab to view your inventory and fleet status screen. I've got some ammonia. Still need to find this uh, this ship. How do I do that? Let's see. Zones. So I gotta find the ship either way. It's that box, maybe it's that box. Oh, there we are. Okay, cool. Let's do a little more uh, resource hunting.
box. Looks like I got a bunch of viewers. Hello, hello. All right, let's actually do this. I press E. You actually came. Oh, hello. I can't tell you how sweaty we are to see you. <laughs> Your friends? Is that a Maybe? question mark? I am Chief Viscosity Officer Rimdu of the Tyrom. I'm a human of Earth. You think it's nice to meet me? <laughs> That's a wonderful change from the usual disgust and contempt we receive when meeting new species. It's a funny story. You like it. It starts with these guys called the Scribe. They're the ones who shot us down. They're kind of our friends. Yeah, but they shot you down. They hate us. Not great friends, really. <laughs> More accurately, they are our masters and the rulers of a cruel empire that we are forced to serve. We're actually trying to protect you from the Scribe. We began receiving your radio transmissions about 50 years ago. You're a fascinating species. <laughs> and because we knew the Scribe would destroy you if they found you, we've been keeping you a secret from them. Oh, well, that's nice of At you. least we were, until a few months ago. The scribe had evidently received traces of your radio broadcasts themselves. They dropped some pretty terrifying hints that they were looking for you. Oh, no. We were on our way here to stall them, which we did, by getting shot down by them. Hence the distress call. That's a fair point. Still, what's a few favors between <laughs> friends? Well, let me explain. The Scribe are looking for you in this area of space. They don't know exactly where you are, but they will find you. Got a Not a lot of, of humans are going to survive that process. The good news is, we can help you. If you help us first. Most of our systems were squished when we dropped out of hyperspace. Our hyperwave radio was one of them. Which is why we had to call for help the old-fashioned way. Also, half of our entire ship fell off. Now, we might actually be able to repair all that damage, but we will definitely need that other half of our spaceship back. 
It went down on a planet somewhere in your solar system. I'm not sure where precisely. All planets look the same when you're crying. Though if I had to guess, I'd say it was around this one of your larger, sweet. bluer worlds. Also, we lost a couple of hyperdrive modules. We'll definitely need those if we want to not starve to death far from home. Those definitely went down somewhere in your inner solar system. I know this is a lot to ask. But finding all of this shouldn't be a problem for a ship with both its halves. <laughs> the biggest help I can offer is this. We'll be your friends, and not just me and my crew. All Taiwan everywhere. Taiwan. We'll share technology and explain how the galaxy works. And how to avoid getting killed by the scribe. We've been not getting killed by the scribe for a while now. <laughs> not that I'm bragging. Okay, I'm bragging a little. <laughs> so, will you help? Okay, we just try not to think about it too long. Because we'll still die here. <laughs> um, uh, I guess I don't really have a choice, do I? Our new probable friends came back. So, Yay, will you help? Zoidberg is popular. Great! We'll give you so many hugs if you manage <laughs> to succeed. Great! Okay, so. get back to like options gameplay controls Said I should start taking notes. So I gotta go to the inner solar system. The bluer planets, he said, also. That's probably. Our inner solar system for the one thing. There we go, Captain's Log, okay. Investigate. Check with Star Control whether we should help them find Taiwan Station. Okay. How do we check with Quick way to like communicate. I guess we'll just go back to uh, Earth. Just pop 
pop in and say hi. Captain, you survived. Not anymore, it isn't. Hmm. But tell me, Captain, what did you find out on Triton? What? Well, it sounds like you did the right thing offering to help, Captain. Our exobiologists have been studying the recordings of your conversation with the alien. Based on their word choice, blinking, and overall clamminess levels, we believe that this one was genuinely in fear for his life. So we've come to a conclusion. We want you to help them. This is too great an opportunity yeah, to pass I, up. I was already doing that. Just remain cautious. There's no what reason to trust these Taiwan fully just yet. Well, if what this Taiwan says about the scribe is even remotely true, I think we need to help. The chance to establish friendly relations with an alien civilization is too great to pass up. Especially if they can in any way help us stop a threat to our civilization. Go find the missing parts of their ship, Captain. They should be around here somewhere. All right. Good luck, Captain. All right. So, I said inner solar system. Let's start with Mars. Sir, we're detecting two unidentified objects on the surface of Mars. Is this something to do with Alexites or something else entirely? Yeah, I don't know, dude. They're unidentified. What? Do I have to save? This looks like part of an alien spaceship, Captain. I bet this is one of the hyperdrive modules those aliens are missing. We'll load it up onto the lander now. This looks like part of an alien spaceship, Captain. I bet this is one of the hyperdrive modules those aliens are missing. We'll load it up onto the lander now. Oh, I see. So that's the staff. That's the crew. There's the fuel. That's the cargo. Patterns for any authorized sentient being. EM broadcast detected. Spectrum analysis. Technological development level T3. 2D image in broadcast identified. Processing. Facial edge discrimination does not match known sentience in this sector. Ooh. You are not a Taiwan. Who are you? We 
remain where you are. A scribe legate has been notified of her unauthorized existence and is approaching this sector now. Hold. Transmission incoming. New orders received. Local fleet Probe Vessel Zero will clear system of unauthorized organic vessels. Uh -oh. Continue to remain where you are. <laughs> See how that works. Let's, uh, refuel. You're back. How did your mission to help the alien go? You were what? You heard me. Well, that's terrifying. And that confirms it. If they can help us in any way learn more about these scribe, we absolutely need to help these Taiwan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going to keep analyzing the situation here. As for you, your orders remain the same. Get out there and find the Taiwan's missing ship parts, Captain. Good luck, Captain. Okay, he said one of the bluer planets. So I'm gonna look over here at whatever loom that is. Robot. Sir, we're detecting an unidentified object on the surface. We may want to send a lander down to investigate. is stable. This is a heck of a thing, Captain. We found some kind of monument here. At least, I think it's a monument. It's a big, multicolored slab of metal with odd protrusions sticking out of it. Balls and sticks, kind of. There's uh -huh. text on it, or graffiti. Pictures of aliens fighting? I'm honestly not sure. No human language, anyways. Not much we can do with it, but admire it. And... done. Done? We'll just leave this here, then. It. All right, well, we found a thing. Let's check it out. That's not what I wanted.
nicely designed so far. I mean, let's see how the uh, plot goes. Looks like an old Russian space probe, Captain. It's neat, but not much we can do with it. Well, thanks, jerk. Oh, yeah, no, I'm not Captain, the weather on this planet will make landing very difficult. We'll need better landers to manage it. So it's not here. Um, maybe out here. Is that looking trite? Oh, that's where I started. Either way, let's go talk to him. Our new probable friends came back! <laughs> Why not hey, did you get everything we need to repair our vessel? You did? That's not good. 
Did you tell them we were here? Well, now that sounds extremely not good. Like I said, if you help us repair our ship, we might be able to help you deal with these scribe. So, have you found everything we need to repair our vessel? That's great! That's almost very helpful. Almost. There are three parts. The part that completely fell off, which we need to live, and the two hyperdrive parts. They should be in your solar system somewhere. You want to learn more about- I have no- What do you want to know? Best friends. So you think you can help us now? Great! Great. It's Artemis. Yeah, ever since we found this thing all the way out here in the 40s, scientists have been wondering if it would get more interesting. And, uh, nope. Not today. Captain, we're detecting movement on the surface. Looks like some kind of robotic drones. It might be dangerous to send the lander down unarmed. Captain, this is the lunar facility the Lexite settled after they first left Earth. We've sent surveyors here before, and I don't think much has changed since then. Not from all the dust I can see. It doesn't look like the Lexites were here long after they arrived in 2085. This was just a staging area they used before traveling elsewhere. No idea where they went after this, but you know that as well as I do. Finding them is why we have a star control in the first place. Captain, there's something powering on here. Blinking lights, humming sounds. There's a computer screen turning on. It says, threat to remnants detected. Lander self-defense technology ready to be used. Insert uranium to power. 
There's a slot in the device here. Do we have any uranium we can feed this thing? I don't... I don't keep that on me. We'll have to come back later then, or ignore this entirely. Your call, Captain. You're back. How did your mission to help the alien go? Oh? Like what? You did? Those aren't cheap, Captain. Neither are the poor guys who drive them. Unfortunately, things are a little tight around here. Even making payroll has been challenging. I have not been too popular around here lately. Return here with any resources you find on your travels. We'll use advanced space accounting practices to determine what we can build with them. This will all be presented to you as resource units, or RU, which you can then exchange for fuel or other supplies. Anything else? Is there anything else? Good luck, Captain.
Captain, this planet is well beyond our ability to land on. We'll need to find some way to improve our lander technology. Captain, this planet is well beyond our ability to land on. We'll need to find some way to improve our lander technology to... Sir, we're detecting an unidentified object on the surface. We may want to send a lander down to investigate. This looks like the part of the ship that friendly slug is missing. We'll load it up onto the lander now.
Our new probable friends came back. Uh, did you get everything we need to repair our vessel? Great! Now we can fix our ship. It worked! <laughs> We've repaired the hull damage and restored power to our propulsion systems. It will take another minute or so to get our needed. defensive systems online. So please, don't murder us! <laughs> Great! <laughs> so, my new damp chum, why don't we head back to Earth? You can introduce us to your parents and leaders. We can tell them what we've told you, or we could just hang out. Yeah, be pals. Most definitely. <laughs> But we have procedures to minimize the health-related risks of contact with alien species. Meeting aliens is not new to us, human. Hooray! Told where to exist. With all explanation will take several valuable minutes of the world day. So I will give you the short one. You are trespassing. The stars cropped in the sky. Where did that come from? That's a rhetorical question, actually. I know exactly where that came from. A bad, bad place. We're still repairing our weapon systems, Mission so we won't time. be able to help you, which is a shame because we really, really wanted to do that. Good luck!
Good luck! Oh, what's this? again. We're still repairing. Good luck!
<laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. I just want to try these out now. <laughs> Six Awesome. Drenkind Carrier.
Oh, that's one of the Taiwans. Okay. Obviously, this is going to be a hard game. Um, I'm going to have to uh, come back to the later because it's pretty ridiculous. Um, so, uh, thanks for watching. I will probably try to stream the entire game. It's maybe boring. I'll probably hit mute a bunch of times. But there we are.